am Dr. Doris, Clinical Oncologist, and I'm here to guide you on your cancer journey. Alright, some of you may feel, Ayah, why I have to come for five weeks? Every day must come to hospital Monday to Friday, right? Or some people say, my lagi teruk, seven weeks, right? But some only one day, some only three days. Why do we have so many different days of radiation? Okay, not because doctor trying to earn your money, okay? But actually, it is the different type of cancer. Different types of cancer have different uh, times of radiation. Some treat only one day, some three days, five days, all the way up to seven weeks of treatment. Why must treat so many times, right? Why so troublesome now with new technology? Why cannot just one day treat everything? That is actually because when we give radiation to a certain area, remember, there will be side effects. We will actually cause uh, some damage to the surrounding tissue, to the skin, to the you know uh, bowel tissue, to the nerve, or things surrounding that area. But the difference between cancer cells and normal cells is our normal tissues can actually recover, it can heal itself. So when we give you small bits of radiation over many, many days, we give time for your normal tissues to recover itself. And then we'll make sure that your side effects is much, much less, your treatment is much more tolerable, but we will still get the same effect that kills the cancer. So that is the reason why we treat over many days. Not because we want to torture you, okay? And not because we want to uh, make life difficult. The reason is actually safety. Then, what some of you say, how come mine is five times? How come I hear other people, my friends, same cancer, but need to treat 20 times? Or some say, mine also same cancer, but treat 25 times. Why so many difference? Actually, all cancers are treated differently. Even the same cancer can be treated very differently, right? So it actually depends on what type of cancer you have. What is the aim of treatment? Some treatment is used to totally cure the cancer and that usually is treated over a longer period of time. Some treatment is because you are bleeding from the cancer, got a lot of pain, and that is usually treated over a shorter period of time. But then there is some treatment which is more advanced now, where we only want to treat one tiny dot, okay? So we can actually treat that over a very short period of time, sometimes even one day we can do it. So you come today, tomorrow we can start your treatment, then you're finished already. So it actually depends on not only the type of cancer you have, it also depends on why are we giving you the radiotherapy. And finally, it depends on also different cancer types. So that is very important. Okay? And that's the reason why we can never compare. Even one same cancer is treated many different ways. So if you have to come every day, how long you must stay in the hospital each day? Actually, the treatment is very fast only, right? We can, when we turn on the machine, it only takes two minutes for the treatment to be over. And during that two minutes, you don't feel anything. But then there are some treatment that takes longer. Sometimes it takes all the way up to 30 minutes for the treatment being on, right? But it is always done as a daycare, which means that you come, you treat, you can go home. You don't need to admit in the hospital. You don't need to rest for a while. You don't need... The moment you finish treatment, you can go home because you won't feel anything usually during the treatment. But of course, if you're not feeling well, please let your doctor know. Lah, ha? Don't go and brave, brave, drive home, okay? So that is very important. But a lot of times, you don't have to stay in the hospital. You just come, treat, and you can go home. If you found this video helpful, like and share this video. I'm Dr. Doris Chow. Bye!